and welcome back to another vlog so today we're traveling again and I'm going to Saudi Arabia not a lot of people is visiting there yet but um, last 2019 they are now accepting tourists so before it's just for business and religious purposes but now they're open for tourists there are ways to go in there. There are certain citizens of countries you can get e-visa, which is easier. You can do it online. But for me, Philippines is not eligible for that. But I have a existing U.S. visa. As long as it's used, they can give you visa on arrival. So I booked my flight through Saudi just to be sure because there's not a lot of information in the internet and also once we process the visa um, you need to pay 480 real. Uh, just a trivia, I was born here in Saudi until I was 7 then transferred to the Philippines so yeah and I think that's it. Yeah, let's explore Saudi. first official full day here in Saudi Arabia first stop we're here at Shalal cafe there's an entrance fee of 10 reals and we drove from the airport to here it's my first time driving in other country aside from Philippines and UK and I'm with my mama hi <laughs> Nassim Country Inn. I found them on booking.com. You can check them out. They have a orange car and parking as well. Nice accommodation. p.m. here because it's best for sunset views. Eating fries and chicken after this one we'll go home then tomorrow we'll start the day by a head grab tour. So looking forward for that one. That's it for tonight. See you tomorrow.
Good morning everyone. We're here at Winter Park getting ready for our Higra tour. So we need to book this through uh, Experience Alula website and you can't go there on your own so you really need to book this tour to experience it. The third one will be Jabal Al Banat, where you can find an open tomb so you can enter it. And the fourth one will be a D1. And the fifth one, the last point, will be the handicraft pavilion. So please enjoy as much as you can. been here but I would like to go back here to see it during daytime here at Starbucks waiting for the restaurants to open at half past one and we'll walk around the old town
this is the last stop for today and for Al Ula, I guess, because after this one, we'll go back to the airport, return the car, and tomorrow we'll go to Taif. <music> My takeaway for this Saudi vlog is that Saudi just opened their doors for tourism last two years and so not everyone knew about it so I think this is um, the best time to share that Saudi has more to offer more to discover it's a beautiful country filled with beautiful landscape I'll try to give a detailed information in the description box about my trip here to Saudi because as I said um, it's not that famous yet to other travelers because as I was trying to research how to go get here it's kind of difficult so I'll share that one and see you in the next vlog I guess um, yeah talas bye